Oh my god, that's so dangerously just at the level that we have some space to go more and more upward. Hi guys, my name is Anna and I'm into the binary options trading. That's a little bit windy because I'm in Dubai Resort and I'm at the Lamborghini. So guys, if you want to know more, if you want to get more results, profits, knowledges, you can just proceed to my Telegram link, to my Telegram channel where I post 12 signals per day and you can use it and get the same. Hi guys, here is me, Anna. I am today at a pocket option, just as always. Today we're gonna be using the nicest and the, one of the most important strategies because the indicators that I just picked up and tested, quite fine. So we're gonna get to some of the results and don't forget if you are so, so tired of massive theories, this is just the strategies that I can recommend for easy and nice profit. Guys, let's get it started, of course, with a one minute interval of 375. It's gotta be the whole sum we're gonna be investing. And just a kindly a little reminder about the giveaway that the platform is kindly offering for us. So you need to follow all the instructions and conditions and you may have a chance. Um, here we are with all these stocks the biggest payouts and we're gonna be proceeding to all of the setups it's gonna be 10 seconds candles and we're gonna be having RSCI, OSMA and alligator so alligator and i must say RSCI already is got a good combination but we're gonna be just pairing that with this candle indicator which is gonna be i think perfect and maybe you have noticed i have my new braces on and I am just moving slowly in that direction <laughs> because if you're wondering what's what happened actually in this area that's my new one and I think in a few weeks I'm gonna be as the pupil I'm gonna be as a schooler with all of my mouth and metallic constructions in it so I just got distracted all the setups just copy the numbers copy the periods and we're gonna be proceeding all of that colors just a tiny bit and the, then we're gonna be going save it save it work out that's it i think it's gonna be the nicest one because that's already easily readable and it seems like the safest strategy because we have lots of different signs can be actually combined in the one a big strategy so and here we are from the distance it looks a little bit complicated but what we can see right there i'm just gonna be starting with this smallest one i think that's the bottom and i just do expect that after after a little while we're gonna be getting up for it here we are we actually don't need some heavy explanations right there maybe only because of about the alligator that actually if that line three lines got crossed changing the direction but we expect that's gonna be the massive change and sometimes we need to be a little bit a little bit earlier and then all of that happening we have this rsci and osma showing to us that it's the bottom so we do expect that's going to be the changing and only now we can see the alligator lines started to get changed started to get a little bit more upward and before that was i couldn't say risky but that wasn't so sure and now of course the alligator lines just reacting on the big and massive changes it's not like it's not gonna happen on the chart and the alligator gonna be showing to us that, no. But this is just the additional sign of us being calmly incorrect. That's the first problem. Okay. Let's see, we can add some shapes, just see that better so we can see some crossing. And this is just gonna be the direction, the tendency. Let's raise the bat. That's gonna be 450. And 
this is how we actually get in all of that expected so this is our expectations on that bad i must say that even with that figures even with that graphics it's way way easier but the thing is the market and the chart just need to hear us you know and we need that to follow what we do expect and right there i must say of course we can see the alligator lines trying to get upward but i think we are somewhere we are somewhere at the peak it's just something like that was complicated rising maybe and i do expect that it's gonna be maybe complicated but falling because it doesn't seem it's gonna be more rising and does it seem that it's gonna be that we have some space to go more and more upward so that's how my expectations went to that yes went to that downward trend went to the downward trend and said look at the alligator lines right now it is it is it is closing okay let's check what we have more this one mm, look at this alligator the blue line is just getting so parallel it's kind of it's kind of interesting situation so i think that's the peak uh-huh out of the chart and out of the market seems like the peak but if you're going to be checking rci and osma seems like we already and that's true we already getting downward but you know when you actually getting into that trading seeing all of the signs that may be actually the middle because all of these indicators can actually show us tendencies and the changes a little bit a while a little bit earlier so when you have all of that working for you that could be an end and that's the problem by now i am a little bit okay with the expectations because they'll get a line still showing to us that we're going to be going downward and closing but we are oh my we are so dangerously just at the level oh my god that's you know how actually <laughs> this is hard to catch this type of situation where it's just the same level so i was like so so correct but i must say that i am like it really and truly because i had i had this growing right after so in a second that would be the lose no win but lose and how about this one what we can say about that this is what i actually been telling you at the previous chart when you already got all of that going maybe that's gonna be safer if you gotta get into the opposite direction because that's gonna be a little bit a while but of course you need to look at the chart quite precisely being being preoccupied so look at that Look at this alligator, look at that crossing, that's the moment of crossing that we actually needed. I think it's going to be somewhere here. And yeah, and with the alligator it's a little bit complicated because sometimes you do expect that after that crossing we got to get downward because it seems like it. But right there is just fine, they get it crossed and they may go upward, it's just fine. That's why this indicator is not so easy maybe as MACD or stochastic oscillator we're crossing and crossing and we can expect we can rely on it no it's fine it's fine i think the timing is perfect yes yes it is started to get downward that's the peak but we just we just made it so kindly render one more time this is the giveaway and 28 days left so or maybe it's your time that's gonna be the different time frame forget about the dates remember about the giveaway and we're just done so if you want to get more if you want to know more about anything in trading particularly or uh, about the trading and pocket auction particular, you can actually find all the links below this video just in my bio i'm gonna be right there tapping you the answers on your questions so just proceed and find me if you need that